Are you subscribed for three months? Wait, really? I don't even remember you subbing for two months, but all right. Yeah, thank you for three months. Holy shit, has it really been three months? That's crazy. <laughs> Anyways, uh, the plan today for the stream is really just Yulala. Uh, while we're waiting for more people to come in, I'm going to do a quick recap on what has been happening off stream. Heavenly Tower, I've gotten all the way to floor 40. I've actually gotten a decent amount of uh, attempts on floor 40 as well. A lot of them are just no rich though, uh, but I have been practicing Yulala a little bit. Another is Legrim. I have done Legrim all the way to max. What I did for Legrim is pretty much just this. Mainly did a CPU lineup and that's pretty much all. I also did, I did Perfect Cyclone Revenge. I... I stack cyberpunk if you just want to know. Uh, I stack a lot of cyberpunk. I stack like five cyberpunk. My cyberpunk is level five slow, I believe. What else had happened off stream? I don't think there's been much. Oh, I did Baku. I did Baku revenge off stream. And this is pretty much what is making me think of doing Yulala in the first place. I have done a lot of attempts on Wawa. None of them are none of them are successful. Unfortunately, as you can see, the lack of glass cap. Um, but I have leveled up some stuff just to make sure that, uh, like Zamboni. I also boosted Manic Dragon to 34, which is funny because like, when I was looking up a lot of things that they want to boost up for Yulala, the threshold for certain units to be able to tank an extra Yulala hit, a lot of them are at 34 for some reason. Uh, MKD tanks an extra hit at 34, Vendor tanks an extra hit at 34, Zamboni tanks an extra hit at 34, a lot of units ended up tanking an extra hit at 34. Fishman, I believe, tanks an extra hit at 38. I don't want to get distracted by gambling too much, so I'll just run a gamble on whether I can beat it the stream or not. The lineup that I've been using for Yulala is this. All of the attempts that I've done so far is using No Rich. I I'll do one more attempt, No Rich, and pretty much every attempt that I've gotten so far have been around 50-40% for pretty much the maximum, uh, well, the minimum HP that I've gotten. So. Not that much luck there, unfortunately, but eh, I would say if I use Rich, maybe I would have gotten a better chance, but yeah. Why Liberty? Oh, you already know why Liberty. You already know I'm the Liberty. Oh my god, blogger, you absolute dipshit. Can this knock back? Okay, good. Uh, uh oh, no, no, no. Nice, 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 nice. Ah, uh, never mind. Wait, that's... No, that's whack! Ah, oh, that's whack. Oh, that's fucked. Okay. I'm dead. Ah, uh, that was a lot of bad interaction. Oh well, that's fine. I guess I'll use Rich now. Yeah, I gotta use the Yulala fingers. The Yulala fingers has to get back to me. Let's begin. I very much could possibly just still immediately die if I fuck up in the beginning anyways, right? Bad Piggies team? Okay, fuck. Whatever, it's fine. Okay. Ah, oh, that's not what I want. No! Really? He hits? Oh, that's f that's so bad. That everything that I don't want to happen happened. He was like barely outside of range too. That sucks. Okay, MKD time. It's time for the Yulala fingers. Oh no, my Yulala fingers are already fucking up. Oh boy, here we go. Oh, MKD! Oh, that- wow! That was all very scary. Oh no, my Yulala fingers missed. You bloggers! Oh, that's perfect! Oh, that's perfect! Oh, that's very perfect! Whoa, the amazing Wicked Bahama chain! Oh, that's re- Oh, no, 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 no. That's almost perfect. That's almost perfect. That's so good. That was really good. That was really good. That could have been better. That could have been better. But that was still really good. I'll take it. Surely this knocked back. Okay, good. Okay, fine. Yeah! <laughs> Holy shit, easy! Not even close, baby! Wow! I forgot how much tourists carried this stage. That was really quick. It's only been 15 minutes on the stream. I might do Infernal Tower off stream. And if I'm able to get to floor 30, I'll do it on stream. I'm not even sure if I have the chance to even go to floor 30 at the first place with what I have. Ah, oh, that was, that was hype. That was hype. I, I like this. 
Uh, no, actually, you know what? I'm not even sure if I like this stage. <laughs> Do I like this stage? Do I like this stage? I don't know. That second Awakened Bahamut is so nice. You're not allowed to like it. Yeah, you know what? You're right. I'm not allowed to like you, Lala. Fuck this stage, honestly. <laughs> oh, that was... Wow, way smoother than I expected for sure. You cleared Heavenly Tower floor 40. Do floor 41, I can't. As in like literally the game won't let me because I have not done as well. You see this? The challenge stage was first clear all of Stories of Legend stages. So yeah, I actually just straight up cannot for now. Uh, that was fun. But now we got Infernal Tower. I'm going to do a little bit of Infernal Tower on uh, off stream. Let's end the prediction right now. 93% of believers. I'm actually a little bit surprised on how much bait you put in me. Yeah, okay, hold on. Why is 93% of you believing that I can beat floor 40 of all things? When I did Big Bang 2 of COTC 2, 45% of you doubted me. What the fuck was up with that? <laughs> We know you are sweaty. Let's claim our reward. Masculala. There we go. We got the boy. The guy who desperately needs a true form. Will I be using him? Probably not. Let's be real here. We're gonna have to wait for Infernal Tower floor 40 extension. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm actually still working right now. And like after I end stream, I'm going to continue working. <laughs> I'm still going to continue my programming work. <laughs> Maybe like I may not be able to clear Infernal Tower, but at the very least, I want to do a little bit of it. Thank you for coming to the stream. Bye bye. Today's plan is clearing out Infernal Tower, which is, uh, yeah, that's, uh, kind of a big deal, actually. Well, okay, first of all, there's a lot of things that are happening off-stream, obviously, most of them being in Infernal Tower. How about we jump in first? Last time, we went through at least all of the available Heavenly Tower that is available to me, and that is up to floor 40. And, uh, yeah, I pretty much done most of Infernal Tower off-stream. There's only, like, 12 hours left for Infernal Tower, so I decided I'm gonna do, like, most of them off-stream. 18 is okay, 19 is okay, and then 20. This is where the stages starts to get interesting, right? I don't have Super Cat. I don't have Bear Cat. I don't have Glass Cat. My only true anti trait list is Mercia. So, what do you think I did? I Cyberstack. <laughs> I don't really have much other choice here, let's be real here. <laughs> um, uh, Dancer Cat kind of a big ass range, and if I'm not able to rush Dancer Cat down with like Super Cat and stuff like that, my only other choice is Cyberpunk. 21? Infernal 21 is not really different from Heavenly Tower 21, so the lineup isn't really that far off either. Ku and Saki going nuts as usual. 22 is the one with Miss Devil. Oh, right, yeah, I just I mainly just used Ray. I actually almost died here. There, look at that. Uh, when I, when I, by the time I won 422, the ninja is still pushing, and it actually pushed all the way to my base. <laughs> Luckily, we still got that under control. And then here, 423, I cyberstack. <laughs> and I have a very good reason on why I cyberstack here. I have not cleared off uh, COTC tree treasures. Therefore, look at that mole right there. That mole is tanky as fuck. So for floor 24, I decided to true form someone. And that someone is Masamune. I true for Masamune off stream. He'll be able to clean off the Lenore and all that stuff like that. So I decided to true for Immortal Masamune. But when I tried out 424 anyways, I fucking died very terribly. The erratic dojos and the squirrels and all that stuff just pushes immensely fast, and I just don't have any chance to defend myself. This was one of the stages that I was oh, immensely worried that I might get stuck on. So I decided to opt in into a certain strategy. I was going to stack Nobunaga is what I was planning to do. I was thinking, oh, maybe I could stack Nobunaga and then I'll be able to have like a chance to hit Lenoir and in the end, I'll be able to purple freeze everything is what I thought. That didn't work, unfortunately. Ev uh, the Sorel pushes immensely fast still. Everything still pushes immensely fast. Dark Laser and Leboyne is still way behind. I did not have a chance. So you know what? I decided that when, it when this was happening, how about I cyber stack? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't really have much other choice here. I I had to cyber stack, okay? I don't really have much other choice. Please understand. <laughs> Moving on from that, floor 25, I, I just cheese the stage. It's, it's same thing with normal heavenly tower. Floor 26. 
is where Kaguya goes in. Kaguya went in pretty well here. Mainly just for a while though, but in the end, I wish I recorded this stage. I wish I recorded 426 because of what happened in this stage. As you can see, I brought Vigler to this stage. I just need to deal with three main things, which is Slipnir, Autumn, and the Peons. The Peons, after a while, you know, died off. And after the Peons died off, normally you would think, oh, it's just Slipnir and Autumn. They don't really push that much. It's easy to kill, is what I thought. And so on my first attempt, I brought Masamune to kill off Slipnir. And then I remember, Masamune doesn't outrange Odom. So what happens is that I died after I killed the Angel Cyclone, after I defeated the Peons, I died because Odom and Slipnir just slowly pushed to my base. So I thought, okay, what if I bring Awakened Bahamut? And it worked, except not really. I forgot that the Slipnir is actually really strong. <laughs> And Awaken Bahamut cannot really get in. At one point, by the end of the stage, there are only Gabriel once in a while, there are Mr. Angels once in a while. So what I did, I had Vigler out, and Vigler was able to land a shot because I used an enemy Gabriel as a stepping stone. And what happened was that on one wave, it managed to, one, freeze the Autumn, and two, knock Slipnir back. So that actually allowed me to have Awakened Bahamut freely hit the Odom. That was like a godlike wave. I really wish I recorded that because that was so good. That was so good. 27? 27 is easy. I didn't, it was just a pretty normal stage. I just holy blast uh, Haka and then he just win. 28? I did use Cyberpunk, but I don't necessarily cyber stack. Kaguya here was going nuts. Kaguya is so good in this stage. Kaguya was able to allow me to just use Catasaurus as my only crit unit, which is really, really nice. My Catasaurus is only like 31. <laughs> with level 5 crit and uh, this. Kaguya backing it up, allowing Catasaurus to be able to just be like the main anti-metal unit aside from Kaguya. Yeah, Kaguya was doing really, really well here. Cyberpunk actually didn't manage to do that much here. MML, Mercia, and Vigler was able to kill off the Mr. Mer really quickly. They are on wave duty. They are all able to hit both Loincloths and Mr. Mer. In the end, Mr. Mer died off relatively fast actually, which is pretty interesting, it's pretty good. Mercia actually does so well here. That's about all that I need to catch up. Since I got an Epic Seed when I did Heavenly Tower last time, I was saying that I could use the Epic Seed to True Form Power Cutter, and that I'll say, hey, I can farm Red Seeds so that I'll be able to True Form Power Cutter, which is what we can do. Except I don't think I'm doing it. There are two main things that I can true form. One is Neo Cutter, uh, Backhoe and Pile Driver is not relevant. The other is this, Belly Dancer. This is also another thing that I can true form, and I think I'm going to get Belly Dancer. What do you mean, hell, Nan? Don't know? Belly Dancer is way more worth it, in, in my opinion, than Power Cutter. Yeah, Cutter is good, but that's the thing. That's the exact reason why I don't want to true form Cutter, because Cutter is already good. When I see the difference between, like, Cutter and true form Cutter, it's it's like, oh yeah, it's it's okay. Like, he goes from really good to really good plus a little bit better. It, it doesn't really change that much, but Flamengo the Belly Dancer actually like grants her the access to the Aku Talons, granting her significant health change and all that stuff. I think Belly Dancer is just the much more obvious choice. I'm turning a useless unit to a unit that I can actually use. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to true form Belly Dancer. I frankly don't really care about Neo Cutter. Alright, so Lord 20 I did get like stuck on floor 29 a lot last time uh, when I was doing it on my main save. I was doing, you know, a little lineup building off stream for floor 29 and this is what I end up with for now. <laughs> There's uh, five Ubers in the, in the lineup right now. <laughs> I can't believe you stole lineup from Matcha and Chazi. Hey man. Like, I would have bring Masamune if I actually have the slot for it. Should I just use Rich? Yeah, I'll, I'll use Rich. Just so that I don't have to stall too much in the beginning. Let's fucking do this. Uh, let's bring back our worst nightmare from before. It's time to face your own fears. I think Brawlers is gonna like. Okay, fine. Uh, yeah, that was a terrible start. <laughs> that, was, that was not the optimal start-off that I wanted. <laughs> what were you guys doing again? 
<laughs> Watching Doctor Strange. Oh, Doctor Strange, huh? I haven't really seen much about Doctor Strange. I mean, what is it even about? I, I know it's like crossover of the century or some shit like that. <laughs> oh, no. Actually, something that I've heard about the new Doctor Strange, I've heard a lot of people think there's a lot of jump scares in that. Like, people were saying it's like, it's kind of a horror movie, apparently. <laughs> what the fuck? What is happening in that movie? What is the movie even about? Like, I'd imagine it has to be something like, Oh, Doctor Strange accidentally opened a portal to Multiverse, and now he gotta fix the fucky wucky. Things are going badly. Evil Doctor Strange is here, and you gotta close the portal to hell or some shit, right? Like, there has to be, like, an evil Doctor Strange, a classic movie Marvel villain. Wanda jump scares? What is going on? It was meant to be a horror movie? What? <laughs> I don't want to spoil it. Yeah, I guess that's fair. I mean, I wouldn't, I'm not planning to watch it anyways, but... Oh no, the Brolos! What the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? That's so stupid! I fucking canoned it too, and it just... It just made it worse. Yeah, fuck you too. I think my erasers are way too weak for this. I don't think my slow beam is high enough. I'm pretty sure my slow beam is pretty low level. Yeah, my slow beam is level 7. I don't think that's enough. Work with me at level 5? Uh, I could give it a shot, I guess, if you say so. Like, if I'm going to bring anything else, my choice would probably be Drama or Volter. Shit. We do got Ken Ken in front now. Yeah, Ken Ken was able to tank that shit, but that shield break was like literally on the worst possible timing. Drama does kind of eat up cash, that's my main concern. There we go. <laughs> I just want to see what happens. Don't break the shield! No! I fucking knew that's gonna happen! Ray, please! Oh my gosh, Cyclops already dead. That was alright, but... The startup could have been better. I do have Dancer Talented. I saw someone talking about Dancer earlier. But I'm not sure if I have the cash for it. Bahamut Cat. Well, you're not wrong there, honestly. I think Bahamut Cat would have been a better choice than Cyclops. <laughs> That's such a sad thing to say. Dancer is leveled up a decent amount. I believe he has... Yep, he has max attack talent. Uh, Crimson Mina, no way. <laughs> I could try Bahamut, but uh, the thing is, if I'm going to stack Bahamut, I don't think I'm able to stack two. And if I'm going to bring, like, oh, a unit to do damage, I'm gonna bring Masamune instead. Yes, Bahamut is the only choice. Ah! Masamune does attack fast. He might actually be able to clear off the Akugori by himself as well. The problem is, Masamune is also pretty squishy. If he gets hit by Akugori, like twice, he dies. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I'll give Masamune a shot. I'll give Ray a little bit more boost so that maybe she'll be able to do a little more with this. Wait, wait what? Ray got hit by Professor A. Oh, that sucks. Ray is almost up. If he can just survive like this one Akugori. No! One of the beefcakes died! One of the beefcakes died. This goddamn Akugori, get out! No, oh my god, Saki got destroyed. We still need to get rid of this one. Masamune. Oh my god. Ah, uh, that sucks. We All of our Ubers died and we immediately got pushed. Ah, uh, that's unfortunate. And also because of Ray getting hit by the Professor A super early. That was a much better run, yeah, for sure. Masamune might actually be the answer. That's what I thought too, but... <sighs> Is it time? Is it time? Yeah, fuck it. Let's try this. <laughs> No! No 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 Fuck Now that was that was actually kind of my fault. Bahamut I don't think Bahamut has hit once in this entire stage. Yeah, I think Bahamut has like missed literally every shot. Let's retry that. Can I stack Saki? Sub Saki for dancer? If I sub Saki for dancer, who's gonna hit Professor A? Who can? But you have to go through the Rainies first. And if I'm able to kill the Professor A before the Rainy, that would be so much better. Okay, uh, let's not spawn Ray yet. Oh my god, I... <sighs> Who got hit by two Brolos? Yep, let's just go now. Fuck stacking. Oh my god! Fuck this stage. My goodness. <laughs> Eat shit and die. Bye-bye, Dancer. I really think it's mainly just the start-off. Like, currently, so far, a lot of the times, it really just boils down to the start-off being really bad. I really wonder if we should've brought Drama still. I don't think Drama's gonna survive long, too, though. Not with these meat shields. Like, I, I reviewed a lot of my previous 429, and the main thing was that I was able to use Rock back then. And Rock was a massive savior, but I don't have that luxury here. No Cyborg? I already said, if I'm going to use Cyborg, I might as well just use Drama. I'm not gonna have money 
money for Cyborg. <laughs> yeah, I was contemplating Ururun too, because she attacks fast, but her damage is really lacking. And also, she dies in one shot. <laughs> that's pretty much why Masamune is in the lineup, and that's why I'm also considering Drama, because I want something to mainly like kill the Aku Dojis. I think Aku Dojis was kind of a pain as well. Whenever Aku Dojis is on the screen, they immediately push. I mean, you can say the same to Aku Gori as well, but it would be very embarrassing if we managed to kill off everyone and then still die from Professor A anyways. Masamune does nothing here? Excuse me? Masamune does a lot. Masamune was one of, the, one of the few that was actually able to clear off the Gori and Aku Dojis. It's actually like really important here. Masamune has honestly done the boss. It's like if I have like three other Masamunes, I would have brought that. If I'm able to like clone Masamune, I think I would bring like four Masamunes, honestly. Because we need something that, actu that actually attacks fast. Just use Megidora. Honestly, I would have if I actually have Megidora. Raid true form costs too much. You know, today is growing green. Raid true form increases her attack rate. Oh, we need eight more fruits. You know what? Let's do this. Let's let's farm. Let's go on a farming spree. This is now a farming stream. I'm very sorry. I think we cracked the code. Uh, maybe. Let's actually give this a shot. I'm actually interested. Eight green cat fruit. The hunt begins now. Can you bleed the floors in HT which gives green fruit? I just beat tower. I just used it up. Oh, wait. What floor is the green fruits? Wait, 19? Really? If it's under 20, I think I can still grab it. Oh, 18. Okay, there we go. We can get three from there. I started at 21. So everything after 21, I already grabbed. But if it's below 21, I can still do it. Oh my gosh, this is such an old ass lineup. Floor 12 gives five seats too okay know that i'll also do that then i'll see about it i'll see about it lexi is such a funny enemy yeah lexi is great but there's also you know that donny dash or whatever his name is oh, okay that one oh my gosh this another old ass lineup that one face enemy that just drops a shoe on you yeah that's uh, that donny dash there we go Right, uh, we'll do one more. I think we should be able to get the true form now anyways, right? Yeah. All right, here we are. There it is. Ray, you better make this worth it. Let's do this. Yeah, lend me, lend me your energy, please. I guess we'll try and go with this or something. Let's try this again. <laughs> Ray, please. Wow, Ray attacks really fast. What the hell? That's a- that's a vast improvement? Yeah, okay, Ray- Ray's true form is actually attacking super fast. What in the world? Okay, well, she died, but honestly, that's pretty good. Dancer, please. Dancer, please! Ray's almost up again. Why did I spawn- why did I do that? <laughs> now I have no money to spawn Ray. Why, did, why the fuck did I do that? Why the fuck did I do that? Why did I why did I spawn Saki? Where brain? Yeah. What the, why did I spawn Saki? Yeah, but that was a much better improvement. I'm starting to dub dancer. I'm sorry. You are doing well, but you do like one attack before you die, and that actually makes me kind of worried. Okay, you know what? Yeah, you go Saki. You go hit the base Saki. I could still try out drama. We haven't tried out drama. Oh my gosh, I don't really have anything for the start off aside from drama. Can I rely on drama for this? If this is slapstick, I'd be so much more confident. Confident. Did you get fucking one-shotted? <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> you got one-shotted by the Aku Dodge? What the fuck? Are you kidding me? How weak can you be? What is the Aku Doge magnification here? 600. 13, 200 damage. Drama Cats at 36 has 12,000 HP. Fuck off. <laughs> oh my god. What about level 40? Level 40 survives a hit. Oh my god, this goddamn unit. <laughs> oh my god, you're so weak. So are you liking this floor yet? Honestly, yeah. I like this floor. <laughs> I think this floor is pretty neat. No, more like, I, I wish the start off actually gives more money. Original 429 has Dark Doges, right? And Dark Doges actually gives you money. This one kind of don't. Cannon is almost up. Okay. Oh my god, Akugori! Holy shit! Did you see that? That was brutal! Akugori just says fucking be gone, hot. I'll try level 40 drama, just so that she can survive longer. Uh, okay, Can Can, thank you very much. Ooh, the wombo combo from the two mistress of missing again. Oh my gosh, the beefcake's still alive? Uh, the beefcake died, but that was too late. But that was good. That was good. I'm gonna try this again. Next run, uh, if there is a next run, hopefully there isn't, I'll, I'll boost Ray. Let's get funky. Let's get stupid. No, Saki, no! No, Saki's dead! Okay, unfortunate. <laughs> Bit more. Not again. Uh, but this lineup definitely feels like it. 
you know, just a bit more. This lineup is definitely it. Or rather, Ray is definitely it. We could boost Ray a little bit more. Yeah. Okay. You know, Saki has been sitting at level 28 this whole time. Maybe I should have leveled her up a little bit. We'll level Masamune up a bit as well. We might as well, right? Since we're already on the grind. Also, we might as well do this, actually. <laughs> Probably should have done that. Right, let's try this again. Check the chat, we had a debate. That's exactly why I don't want to check chat, because you guys have debates. Also, this is a really fitting team for like a boss fight, but this is just a start off. So it feels a little bit off. Ah, oh, this is so epic. Yeah, let's like stack up on Aku Doges. <laughs> I was wondering how Battle Cats have that much view and I saw it was you and it makes sense. Oh my gosh, we have 145 viewers and all of you guys are just fucking watching me stacking shit in floor 29? <laughs> you guys don't have anything better to do? There's 145 of you watching me eating shit and die. Okay, let's start spawning Can Can too then. Oh, okay, that's fine. <laughs> Did you see that wombo combo from Masamune to Saki? That was so cool. I mean, it was only a seal, so it doesn't really matter that much. But that's so cool. Wait, this is... What the fuck? This is so good. Did one of the beam kicks already die? What is going on? What the fuck is going on? What in the world is going on? What the... What? What happened? What the fuck happened? What? Midnight D is dead! Professor is dead! What happened? <laughs> Is it really just a small boost that we did that we did to everyone? Uh, what the fuck? Uh, another thing that I noticed, I think Ku was desync like perfectly. What the fuck happened? I didn't even process what the fuck happened there. What the fuck? We just steamrolled it. Station becomes easy after the cyborg whining session stop. You know what? You're actually correct. Whoever it was that was whining about cyborg like this entire stream just decided to stop and we won like i i've been trying to not bring up cyborg this entire time and once chat stopped talking about cyborg i fucking win the cyborg curse this is the cyborg incident floor 30 as you can see i still have seal that means plus levels are disabled still even though there's technically nothing that i have that is above the seal level anyways it does disable the plus levels which is going to be pretty troublesome since we did pass floor 29 this means that it is now safe to talent dancer cat. Finally, we have our weapon. You better carry my ass here. Yeah, f even Fishman at 40 already can't tank the hit. Unless I do a defense up. I can use Field Dance. Gato Amigo is Surge Immune. I feel like it's going to be more useful. And I'm going to bring Can Can and Dancer anyways, right? So... <laughs> Cyborg defense combo! No! Shut the fuck up! I'm, like, banning Cyborg now or some shit. Cyborg retired. No, I'm still getting Cyborg. I could try without first and then just see what happens. You know... Can I upgrade you? Huh. I feel like Dancer's already taking your job. I'm sorry, man. I don't know, KG. I'm not really sure if this is your time yet. <laughs> Give KG so love. He hasn't been in the spotlight for a while. Yeah, but... Key Master? Oh, God. Key Master is made for the stage. Key Master fucking sucks here, to be honest. Which one? Which is it? Uh, I'll just get a feel of the stage without using Rich. Here we are. 430. Mask Grandmaster, here we are. Let's fucking do this. Oh. Maybe I should have. Oh my gosh, you're still alive. Bun Bun, please! How? That Bun Bun survives so long. The little Bun Bun is stronger than EOC Tree Bun Bun? Oh my god. I, I can kind of see that. Oh boy, here we are. I, I don't totally. Oh, fuck. God damn, just one bun bun. <laughs> Usually, most of the time, 
You just need to beat two little bun buns and you are set to win. Just quickly clear up to 38 UL and get Doro on forehead. Yeah, you know what? You're right. I don't think I'll be able to do much with cat jumps, but I'm going to try it. We might as well give it a shot, right? Okay, let's see if this works. Never mind. Oh my god, so strong! Just deal half a million damage in one hit. Easy. Oh yeah, yeah. Just just get last boss forehead. Get away from me and Uber like KG. It seems bad, but I think with Dancer it'll do a lot. I mean I gotta think about how to deal with the little bun bun first. Healer cheese? What the fuck is a healer? God, if I have rock. The same thing with floor 29. All your problems are because no rock. Yeah. If only I have that boulder cat, there's a strategy to make her mid attack. Is it time to try KG out? We might as well give it a shot, I guess. Here we are. Piss KG? It's finally time. We finally get you. Finally is showered. I was gonna say showered in love, but you know what? He's just showered in piss right now. Let's give you a shot and see if you're actually worth bringing out. Or you're just going back to the dump. <laughs> Step two, cover yourself in piss. Yeah, exactly. Holy shit, he won't die! Oh my gosh, he's dead. And my base is like... And it's last leg. <sighs> Here we are. <gasps> oh, oh my gosh, it's dead, it's dead, it's dead. Oh my, no, Sinner Snake, please don't do this to me. No, 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 no. You little fuck! Oh my god, <laughs> you little shit. Okay. 47%? Really? That was way farther than I thought. I should have been more aggressive, I guess. I could definitely still bring Rich and I could definitely still like trade radars to Rich Cat and Guardian of the Rich. No, wait, today's Monday. I can just farm Rich Cats. You know what they say, the power of money, right? Oh, unskated. Very nice. Okay, here we are. Okay. Sinner Snake! Oh my gosh, that was so close! Oh god, I shouldn't have. Why? 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 Why the fuck? It's the same goddamn doge! Oh, fuck, here it comes. Oh! What the fuck? That's an amazing interaction, KG, holy shit! That was clean! Okay, you did well, KG. Oh, focus! Focus! God damn it. Here it is. Whoa, Waken Bahamut! How the fuck did you do all that? Clean! Once again! Good dancer. No! Oh my gosh, the Sinner Snake again was causing me a heart attack. How many knockbacks do you have left? I'm so scared. Here's the Dark Doge. It's always this Dark Doge. Sinner Snake. Sinner Snake got fuck, okay. This has to be it. This has to be like the final scratch. You gotta be close, right? I'm greedy. I'm too greedy. I'm too greedy. That Octo was the worst Octo of my entire Battle Cats career. Are you serious? You're still alive? What the fuck? Please no more little bun bun. Oh, oh my gosh, do you know how much I have held my breath for that? And of course, the one that takes it all, the one that actually did the final shot on the Hermit, 
this cagey. I, I'm, I'm kind of panicking for no reason. I thought the little one has to be like on the edge of appearing. Okay, here's the little one. Oh my god. We did it, boys. Let's fucking go. Fuck off, little boy. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of Sinner Snake surges. We fucking did it. Infernal Tower. Before SOL clear. We fucking made history, boys. Okay, maybe I'm pretty sure someone else has already been doing this. But still, 4 hours and 25 minutes. You cleared Infernal Tower floor 30. Gold cat fruit seed. And of course, true form, hermit cat received. We got him, boys. Here he is. Mask Grandmaster Cat. Oh my god. This KG, it was destiny. It really was. It is our first Uber. And of course, Moneko. Wait. Fuck! <laughs> I can't. Oh, fuck. I used the seat. Uh, I used the seat to chew for Belly Dancer. God damn it. No! <laughs> it was just a yellow seat. I can farm it. But Belly Dancer took it. Fuck. Fuck, Gamadodo, welcome back. You you won't believe what happened when you were away, Gamadodo. You won't believe it, Gamadodo. He turned himself into a pickle. Back when Masked Grandmaster came out, it did made me think of something that I was... Initially, I thought, there's no way, like, anyone would get Grandmaster Cat and haven't beaten this stage. And I'm thinking of Emperor Cat. When Hermit Grand, uh, Masked Grandmaster came out, I was thinking, oh, this would be good for Emperor Cat, but there's no way someone haven't beaten Emperor Cat before they they beat a mask grandmaster cat, right? Surely? And yet here we are. Yeah. Look at that cooldown. That cooldown is so fast. He's already at half cooldown right now. Look at that. And we already got two hermits. That's so fast. This unit's so good. Look at that. That's so good. 